So welcome back to another video, guys. Of course, it's another video that's suggested by you guys. And when I made my whole Kage's units only video, one of you guys commented down below that I should do the Yonko challenge. So Chaotic Thorn said that I should use six star white beard, six star black beard, six star Kaido five star shanks and that's pretty much it but i feel like i could add another yonko to this team with that being said let's get right into the video okay so first off uh let me try to get six star white beard real quick and also kaido as well i got a 134 kaido the guy who gave me this guys is none other than navy x flame so go subscribe to this guy because when he reaches 100k subs he's also getting super saiyan 3 rose as his special unit guys so that's gonna be insane all right so we got six star kaido right here who else is there oh yes yeah, six star black beard and six star white beard and then there's also shanks that i need to get so where is shanks at i think i have shanks but at level one though now there's another character that i could add to this team to complete it which would be luffy because they do call him the fifth emperor of the sea in the anime as well and in the manga if you guys are not caught up in the manga it's okay because in the anime they call him the same thing fifth emperor of the sea unless you're not caught up but if you're not caught up bro what are you doing bro it's literally the vanu arc you should be caught up it's too fire emperor of the money literally and i got her to 150 as well so this is perfect all right so since we're using a full yonko team i was thinking that we could go to this place right here um i forgot what it's called in the anime but I, isn't this the place where Doflamingo fought Luffy or is it a different place? I'm, I'm confused. That's what I'm saying. I don't know the name of this. Like, I'm confused using this place or another place. So, I don't really know. But this map is a One Piece map. So, this will definitely work out. Now, you know what? Of course, we're doing this in extreme mode. We don't do no, like normal mode anymore, guys. You guys already know. Because normal mode is too easy. Especially with these characters as well. Luffy with an orb. Bro, busted team. Busted team. Okay, let me place on a bomb before anything. There you go. Okay, so now what can I place down? Literally nothing. Everything costs 600 and up. Maybe by next round, I should be able to place down something. Another thing that's good about this team is that I have Blackbeard. So everything's going to be slowed down. This is a perfect team for that. I don't know how Kaido works though, bro. I want to place down Kaido as soon as possible because I really never used him. Wow, this guy's AoE clone like that as well when you place him down first. That's dope. And also, since they showed Kaido's daughter in the anime, I wouldn't mind seeing Yamato in the uh, game as well. That could be pretty fire. And yeah, I'm about to die, so I should probably place something down soon. You know what? I'm going to place a Blackbeard right here for now. No, I need money as well. Maybe my uh, Blackbeard, or I mean Whitebeard, can stay there for now, I think. And then once I get enough money, I could place something down in the front and then I should be chilling. One of the Yonkos that we're really missing on this game is definitely Big Mom. And Big Mom definitely gonna have like different like stuff as well. Like she's definitely gonna have a five star and six star for sure. So I can see Big Mom being added into ASCD because we all know that ASCD loves their One Piece. Well, not actually not anymore, really. They started adding like different characters into this game like a lot. Like it used to be like mostly One Piece characters, but now we're getting a lot more stuff. Okay, I think I think I'm good. I think I'm good. I, I'm going to place something down like, you know what? I'm going to place my Kaido like right over here. I don't even know if that's a good placement to be honest to you guys. Now, another thing is that I don't really have a ear unit on me. Well, I do, but... It's Luffy and uh, Kaido. And I don't know Yo. which character... Yo, what's good, bro? Not much. I need you to help me with the video. I'm recording. Oh. Okay, yeah. So pretty much just Curse came into the call, but we're back. So um, I'm kind of struggling here, though. I'm not going to lie. It's, it's a little struggle to start off, but I will eventually get to the point where I could literally just place stuff down and just survive because I just need a uh, Luffy down. Once I got the Luffy down, I'm basically good. So... It's just a hard start, though, because look at all these enemies right over here. Like, bro, there is so much coming in. But yeah, I placed the shanks down, like, right over here. Um, decent amount of damage for 7 seconds. We got this dude right here, Whitebeard, and Kaido. I'm surprised how whack Kaido is. Like, 179 damage every 4 seconds. I mean, yeah, he is a leaderboard junior, right? And, you know, Hashirama did replace him, but... Dang, he's trash. Is my Whitebeard gonna be able to kill everything here? Or what's going on? I think he should be good. Yeah, he should be good. Okay, I think I might have to place it on Luffy starting from... Starting from around maybe here? Nah, right over here since he has huge range. Actually, yeah, you know what? I'll just place him there. Okay. Will I survive right here though? Am I chilling right here? Okay, I'm good. Okay, yeah, Luffy's down. Yeah, everything should be so much easier with this. 
and it's wave uh, 10. So I need to get this guy to hybrid as soon as possible. One more upgrade in this guy's hybrid. And then I should probably upgrade Bulma again though. Oh, I can't. Okay. Well, do I have enough to upgrade Luffy again? No, I don't either, bro. Okay, well, yeah, I'm just gonna upgrade Luffy first instead. Or should I just upgrade Bulma though? Because it's only 250 difference. Yeah, I'd rather just upgrade uh, Bulma first because the Ariots are not like nowhere near. So we're good. All right, so the next character I should probably set up right now is a Blackbeard so that everything just starts getting like slowed down. So let's put that all right here. There you go, fully maxed out. We got the slowness too. Let's go, bro. That's what I'm talking about. This team is actually pretty decent. I'm not going to lie. Okay, so I pretty much maxed out all eight white beards right here, fully upgraded. Everything's placed down. So, like I said, guys, I placed everything down in the front. We got the tsunamis coming in right here. We got three. Um, I think there's like more coming in the back. Yeah, there's one more. Okay. Yeah, everything's pretty much getting like insta killed in the front. So, like, some of the white beards don't even get a chance to attack and to summon their tsunami. So that it is what it is. But let me place on a Kaido now. Because, like I said, I haven't seen this guy fully upgraded. So I really want to check this guy out. So let's see. Let's see. What the actual. <laughs> what is that, bro? Kaido is broken. Okay, well, um, Kaido is a broken character. I did not think that he would turn out like this. But he do be chilling, though. He do be chilling. Like, he's just vibing out, bro. Like, he to himself, like, he's still working. Okay, well, how much damage does he does he do? Okay, well, he's a hybrid. 573 damage every 4 seconds with 65 range. Okay, now I can tell why these guys want to remake this character. They definitely should remake this character 100%. It's such a waste of a character. Like, you would think this guy, a leaderboard unit, Kaido, unobtainable. You can't get him no more. Would be crazier. So, yeah, when that revamp happens, guys, that's definitely going to be a game changer for Kaido. That's for sure. But anyway, now I see how trash Kaido is. I was just thinking, like, might as well just set up a bunch of Kaidos right here in the front. Because, I mean, on extreme mode with 500 damage, like, what difference are you going to make, my guy? Literally none. This is what I'm talking about, bro. This is what I'm talking about. The ultimate ASTD team right here. The best setup you could get. For sure. 100%. Okay, so who have I not really placed down yet and fully maxed out? Boom. I actually have not maxed her out. You know, I did a few upgrades on her because it's worth it. So what's next? I got Kaido pretty much maxed out. Whitebeard pretty much maxed out. I should probably place on a few more Blackbeards just to make sure they slows everything down. So let me just do that real quick. All right, let's fully upgrade this guy. I actually haven't really used this guy either yet, but he's already better than Kaido. Okay, 10,000 damage. 10,400 damage every 7 seconds. And decent range. Okay, I guess I'll just keep that Shanks there, but the rest I'm going to set up like normally. So let me put one right there. Put it on last as well. He has a decent AoE cone, not gonna lie. All right, there we go. So I placed on a bunch of Shanks like this. Um, I don't know if it's gonna work out, but I mean, just the fact that he has a nice AoE cone, this will definitely work out just fine. Yeah, just, yeah, this is perfect, I think. This is fine. Now, all that's left for me to do is to place down Luffy's. So Luffy is gonna be like one of the main things that I need for the air units in the later waves. Because I don't think my guy Kaido can handle that with his 500 damage. So, just placing down a bunch of Luffy's at this point, really. Alright, so now that I'm standing here, everything maxed out. I mean, might as well we should talk about the Yonko Big Mom. I mean, she got her Prometheus right with the sun stuff. She definitely would be like a burn unit, right? It would make sense. Then she also got her Zeus. I, I think it's called Zeus. The cloud thingy with the lightning and all that. I don't know what how that would work. Then she also got the sword, the, the sword hat. Now that one, I don't think I have a name for that one. I don't know the name for that one for sure. That sword right there itself is also busted. So Big Mom, if th that would be added to the game, her six star version with the sword, Prometheus, Zeus, bro, she probably would have like 100 range, 100%, 100 range because of the storm she could do with Zeus, Prometheus with the, with the fire. She would probably have even a manual ability because of her soul stuff. Like, she could turn stuff into, like, her allies or something like that. It's, it's, it's a weird power. The soul fruit that she has, bro. All I'm saying is that Big Mom, when she gets added, especially the fact that ASD loves their One Piece units, expect a powerhouse character. Watch me say all this, and then when you get Big Mom, we get something like this kind of stats. Like, Kaido with 500 damage bro that would be the biggest letdown ever we got a bunch of big tsunamis coming in from whitebeard that's dealing 27k damage i mean it adds up when you spawn all eight but it's really nothing crazy oh we got bro look at this 
Never mind, it's dead. But look at this one, though. This one is pretty fast. Now, will Luffy... Okay, Luffy will definitely kill it. What about this one, though? Okay, this one's at 800k HP, but it's already getting shredded, so we're good. Wave 46? Not bad. Not bad and not... Oh, wave 47. Okay, bet. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff they got through, though. I'm not gonna lie. Like, look, they are all slowed down, but I mean, the only unit that could really attack them now, it's just Luffy. And Luffy only reaches towards over here. So, I mean, if I could make it to wave 50 by then, that would be crazy. Okay, wave 48. Two more waves. I feel like I'm going to die like wave 49. Like, right as I reach wave 49, that's what's going to happen. Yeah, it's happening. Okay, well, I mean, I'm about to lose. So, anyway, I think I'm going to end the video right there. So, guys, I mean, pretty much, this was the Yonko team only. I got to, like, wave 49. As you can see, I just got wave 49. I don't think I'm going to get 50. It's not possible, but... Yeah, this was a Yonko challenge only, so it was an idea suggested by one of you guys. If you guys got more ideas, don't forget to suggest them, and I will shout you out, of course, for using your idea. Anyway, thanks so much for watching this video. See you guys in the next one. But first, I want to show you guys me actually losing, because what if I actually do reach wave 50? Hold on a minute. Oh my god, wave 50 is possible, bro. I ended the video too quick, way too quick. Okay, yeah, yeah, wave 50 is definitely possible, guys. Guys, wave, wave 51, wave 51 before Sasuke goes in. Let's go, wave 51, guys. Okay, yeah, so I lost that wave 51. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.